Xbox versus PlayStation is now turned Microsoft versus Sony. Let's talk about it. Sony is buying Bungie, the developer of Destiny and original creator of Halo about a week after the Microsoft bought Activision Blizzard news. Now, I'm not saying Sony buying Bungie is a response to that as these things happen, you know, three to five months, sometimes years in advance. However, it makes me think about how since 2020, esports and gaming as a whole is starting to understand they aren't just the gaming industry, but they are also the entertainment industry. And the way we are doing it is through transmedia. If you don't know what transmedia is, it's basically storytelling through a variety of mediums. Example, getting a happy meal with a toy of a character from a movie or Pokemon is also a great example. What's, what's another great example? Fortnite, you know what they do with the movies and then Fortnite gets the scan. So to end here, don't be surprised when you see more and more of this as this would be a year dominated by by esports and gaming through video game through toys through movies through animations and that's why i say 